Well, I think by them just trying to bypass our uh, negotiating team, uh, that seems to be kind of shady there, right? Because, uh, I mean, we do have people that's in place to negotiate for us as well. And so that way they can kind of go over those things. But uh, that, that itself, I mean, you know, in the sense of uh, not respecting our, our negotiating team to do that and bypass them and trying to get directly to the members, that's not how it should be done, right? That's cowardly. That's just the corporation playing games. You know, it was pretty shocking to see it on the news myself and we had received nothing from the union yet. So it's just another game. I'll leave it at that. I'm, I'm not going to think about anything on the word of mouth or, or on a handshake. We want it in writing. We need to review because something that's not talked about is all the fine print, right? We, we need to look at what's been scratched out or what's been changed. It's all there. But when they just throw out the, this, this what might look good to the public, you know, just to try to make us look like we're greedy when we're not. We're not greedy. Yeah, we, we I have quite a unique occupation here there's nothing like it so we just want to be compensated fairly so and and we're not just what people might think our machine is standing in front of a machine and letting a computer do the work for us it's not like that We've got a large group of brothers and sisters from maintaining facilities so that we can do the work to people who, who put together the parts, pre-assemble them for them, make them available for the mechanics to put them in there to quality to those on the flight line that make sure that that airplane is ready to fly off at its first flight 100% perfect every time.